held on 25th February 2023 in Kazina State are as follows. Total number of registered voters, 3516719, Total number of accredited voters, 1097, Six six three one zero nine seven six six three. Total number of votes received by the presidential candidate of each of the political parties are as follows. Party A, two, five, five, two, five, five, A, A, five, two, three, five, two, three, A, A, C, two, three, four, two, three, four. ADC one four zero five one four zero five A A D P one seven nine eight one seven nine eight APC four eight two two eight three four eight two two eight three Avga one three nine one one three nine one APM six zero three Six zero three APP two six nine two six nine BP three two seven three two seven LP six three seven six Six three seven six N N P P six nine three eight six six nine three eight six N R M one zero five three one zero five three PDP four eight nine zero four five four eight nine zero four five PRP one nine eight six one nine eight six SDP three three nine three three nine YPP one zero two nine one zero two nine ZLP three seven one three seven one Total valid vote one zero five 
1058673 rejected vote 32514 32514 total vote cast 10 91187 101187 Thank you Mr Chairman Thank you Scope Are there polling units where elections did not hold or cancelled Yes sir there are seven, eighteen local governments where uh, were affected, and eighteen REs affected. 95 PUs and 51421 registered voters in total. Do you have the breakdown by PBCs collected? Yes, sir. Okay. How many? 449. Four four. Four four nine four four. Okay, thank you very much. Um, party agents, any comments? Okay, please um, come forward to submit your report. Let me Okay, can you sign in the stamp? Inside the stamp, sign. Our state is around, but will require a few minutes 
uh, with the coalition secretariat. So we remain, we take Nasarawa, and then see if there are other states. We either take a break and come back, or if there are no other states, then we may reschedule for tomorrow and continue. So Nasarawa, please, uh, coalition secretariat be fast so that we can take Nasarawa and any other state that comes. Thank you.
Okay, this is still Verdict 2023 and you're tuned into the network service of the NTA. Um, just before we came on back here, um, the INEC chairman, talking about Professor Mahmoud Yakobo, um, has just stated that um, they're waiting for Nasarawa State to uh, make a presentation already about 13 states have presented results as collated at the state level. Um, just a few uh, moments he asked for before they reconvene again, um, you know, to receive Nasarawa State for the presentation. Ekiti has presented um, Kutsin Ondo, Lagos, Kwara, Oshun State, Yobe State, Oyo State, Ogun State, Enugu State, Gombe, Chikawa, Adamawa, Kasina, and now we're waiting for Nasarawa State. It's a race to finish. And of course, um, eyes are on the four key political parties out of the 18 political parties, talking about the APC, the PDP, the Labour Party, and the New Nigerian People's 
party. Um, already APC um, has collated and has presented, um, let me just take you through some of the results that has been presented. Ekiti, APC is leading with 201,494. Um, votes on those states. APC is also leading with 369,924 votes. Lagos State um, Labour Party is leading with 582 votes and 582,454 votes. Quara State APC is leading there with 263,572 votes. And for Quara State, APC is leading with 263,572 votes. For Oshun State, PDP um, is leading in that state with 354,366 votes. Yobe State, PDP is also leading 198,567 votes. And for Oyo State, APC is taking the lead with 449,884 votes. For Ogun State, APC is also leading 341,554 votes. And for Enugu State, Labour Party is leading with 428,640 votes. For Gombe State, we saw earlier, PDP is leading with 319,123 votes. Jigawa State is lead, um, APC is leading in Jigawa State with 421,390 votes. And for Adamawa State, PDP is leading with 417,611 votes. For Kasina State, PDP is taking the lead with 489,045 votes. We're all awaiting Nasarawa State, as stated by the INEC chairman. Um, we've seen different intrigues play out during the day when the coalition center was in session we saw some political parties um, majorly that's the pdp and the labor party expressed um, their dissatisfaction with the electoral process and you know not agreeing with what is being presented but people have come out to say well the court is there if you have any litigation against whatever process that is ongoing now um, but this is a race to finish and nigerian are optimistic Nigerians rather optimistic that the electoral process, you know, has been seamless. Some Nigerians rather, um, it's been seamless. Everything has been going on um, smoothly as speculated. But we'll keep our fingers crossed. And for us here on the Nigerian Television Authority, we'll continue to dish it out to you as it is presented. Be sure of credible um, information when it comes to the Africa's largest television network. Okay, um, I've just been told that they will resume shortly. So let's um, go back to the collision center. Let's get an ambience to see if the session is back on. Let's see that. All right.
Thank you.